King DDD, Palutena by the other side. Yeah, the, it seems like it's a Fire Emblem I mean, Enjoyer. Yeah, yeah, the, Chrom the, the, and Violet. Kind of the same, but yeah, the the the, the blue or the red uh, the red player with uh, characters with uh, yeah. Look at that, a lot of uh, weird choices. But yeah. yeah, we're gonna go here for. Uh, today and now we're starting squad strikes really good. We have Link and we have Turi. Link against Turi. United States against Mexico. Now on to the bracket. Squad strike. The first player from Turi is King DDD while Link is playing starting with the Joker. Now on to the game. Looks like um the pressure is placing Ling on, on Turi is kind of strong. Look at that, he's not letting him in return to the stage. And once he gets his flashes on the Gordo to to gain some damage. Yeah, this is, is a, a really weak character, you know? Like, it's a, a big body, a lot of combos only work on him. It's kind of slow, his brain shot is sometimes amazing, sometimes not that good. But uh, one of the heaviest characters here, so have a lot of potential tanking stocks here, especially in Squad Strike. So with Ripple Ball, see uh, a lot of... Oh my! Spike. My, looks like King DDD performance is over. And now let's see the goddess of the goddess of light itself, Palutena. But look at that. I feel like um Tori well Link is actually getting good damage within the within the the Aha. However, I feel like now Tori is a lot of pass a lot of pressure on the ledge. But none of that has prevented him to at least uh, reduce the advantage that Downling has. Yeah, and Chad's name that Link is from Puerto Rico. So, okay, a, a lot of representation here. The battle is not Ooh, gonna be Ooh, Nansen's not gonna make it! Oh, and actually really, really. absorb the... <laughs> the explosive flame! Yeah, Watch really it, here comes Arsene once again. And man, Arsene needs... Um, it's a strong character, however, its, yeah. its performance didn't last long, and now on to the... I forgot the name, the Ashen Demon Violet. Yeah, the Violet, exactly like Sakura said, and now we have a, a really interesting match. Both uh, characters have a lot of pressure, a lot of uh, combos, especially with the Nair, Bo both have really similar Nairs, so uh, a lot of the combo route that the possibilities are Almost exactly the same. Yeah, they're trying to go to that uh, fishing nair, trying to get that combo, combo started. But yeah, uh, a lot of good pressure for Turi. The the Palu making great use of the shielded dash attack. Oh, that's the man! Yeah, actually, that's actually, that made it up. And now let's see the Peach performance. However. Mm, it's a hard matchup for for Pilot due its lack of recovery. You know, yeah. he he may have the one of the best headers in the game, yeah. but he's also limited because once he gets gimped, well, it's oh, it's, it's GG for him. 40, 41 and ninety eight, both players on the ledge. However, the pressure that the tourist actually playing on. Oh, oh look, look that, that was that was what I was saying. Like you said, like you said, especially really harsh recovery but now we have Chrome. Chrome has a lot of good nasty tricks on the close quarters here which has to have a little space because oh no look at that Turi making the combos with the turnip <laughs> turning against the turnip within yeah, each man <laughs> that's that's insane 94 and 1 however I, I have to admit that Chrome has the same problem that Violet has his, re his lack of recovery yeah. he he only has a, a, a vertical recovery, and whoa, actually the backer made it, and the first game goes to Turi. Yeah, I was surprised. I, I thought like uh, she was uh, all, all, all the way, uh, she wasn't there, you know? I, I was surprised that backer hit her because she was already on on the back of the crumb. But yeah, th those uh, swords are really strong um, uh, things for characters to use, you know? that those. Uh, extra range, extra limbs, but yeah, catching it now. We're gonna see uh, Link uh, go back to the drawing board. He's thinking a lot of the characters. Gonna go Palu, Peach, and the exactly same. the same combination that, that I've seen maybe that now the counter pick is which order because I, I think uh, Palu made a great uh, a, a great job, but they did not so much. So maybe he's trying to yeah. Now the Palu is on some point. Didi is the mid character and the last character 
is gonna be is gonna be pitch. All right, now Tori starring with Byleth and next to Joker. I have to admit that a strange pick from both of them. However, looks like it is a good start because it's a it's a nair fight. You know, yeah. the the person who connects the nair is gonna be the one who actually combo the other. Yes, especially and now look at that. Both trying to get that combo started. That. Uh, Interaction, big damage from both uh, characters to that nair, and now uh, triggered a lot of damage. But again, uh, he's been sniping a lot of uh, kind of insecure things that Palo has been throwing with that fair, and also getting that sweet spot, sweet sweet spot from Violet's uh, lands. Now gonna be a big punish here. Not gonna be. That's gonna be a really bad situation. But Violet comes from so low, like you said, Ogwa. But now, oh, that, that oh, it's got a mistake. No, looks like the Earhart Tipper didn't make it. However, it's, it's still on, on a small advantage. Well, now I feel like he's attempting to get the the juggle game, but uh, however, he is not managing to do it. How one way or another, he's taking off of the ledge, and looks like Link. It's playing not so pressure on him, but he's like seeking for the bait. He yeah, just, once he Ooh. get baited, he's gonna punish hard. Yeah, that, that DI on the dash that was a little questionable, but still tanking that stuff with Violet. Oh, there's nice. Whoa. Whoa! What a good read. They're going again for the long range uh, arrow that Violet has, but now both both players are fishing for that no. hit, for that strong hit. Not gonna be enough still, wow. and again the, with the challenge with the arrow on the ledge, very aggressive. Yeah, looks like the fail now wasn't enough to to defeat the goddess of and light, again. but well, looks like it was a projectile fight, and at least I see that Tori actually made it. Now DDD is on the game, and as you were saying, DDD is so giant that many combos may land on him. However, it looks like Tori got um, overextension. And there, and there we go. Now Joker is on. However, the Joker's speed is something to be aware of. It, you know, yeah. actually, with all the all the tools that he has, especially the gun, and the, yeah, he can actually reflect Gordos, and that might be a big trouble for for Link. Oh, nice, up, nice rackdown, but we can't get anything. Else. Oh, that, that's what that's one thing like that Link uh, needs to remember that gone from Joker, it's a projectile that it's not a projectile, you know, like it's, it's like a, a physical attack. Yeah, yeah like a physical attack. He, he tried to, to swallow, try to mm. the both. Oh, what amazing drag down, but the timing of the up smash was a little bit off, and now DDD making a really good thing, and yeah, like we said, it's a really chunky boy. He tanks a lot of damage. Now we're uh, back again on the percentage. Fishing for that Gordon, making the the mistake, and that's the backer not gonna be enough. And now we don't have our send. I mean, Joker's a really good character either way, but uh, as I said, DD can tank a lot, and maybe this could be a really hard stock for uh, for Dude. Whoa! Well, oh, the, the trade, interesting trade. <laughs> yeah, that was an interesting trade. However, I am surprised that DDD didn't make it with all the yeah. weight that he has carrying on. Now, the the agility of Joker is something important. However, the float combos that Peach may get are absolutely dangerous because it can get you up to 60% and now seems like Link is not exploding that mechanic however he is actually baiting but wow that was a close one yeah. he's going too low on the ledge and he actually made it there we go the grappling hook and no more damage however the peach found actually didn't make it but as I'm saying oh my watch out because our Zen is about to go out once again Ozzy yeah, and that's really, really uh, scary, you know, like... Uh, oh no, mm, that's gonna he be the didn't make it. But yeah, like, our Sen is also a really good, uh, great uh, comeback mechanic and make a lot of damage. But now we're again with the Princess, and now an amazing read from that jump. Not gonna... Oh, amazing. Also, the interaction, Java back here. Uh, interesting, also really, really true. Now we're gonna go for the low recovery, trying to get back to the stage, but Turi making a really amazing uh, co uh, uh, spacing to cover all the options there on the ledge. Now we have a lot of damage still, maybe jab back here the Jair, not gonna connect uh, as easily, but uh, Ling still trying to get this thing getting on. I mean, he has full rage, he can make uh, a big uh, damage here, like we said, from really... Uh, 
susceptible to getting GM, but the pressure from Turi not making it back to the, not letting the Simone to get back to the stage. Surely. Now, as you were saying, bitch, it's too floaty, man! Whoa, I, I didn't see that coming. I, yeah. I bet Link didn't too, so wow, <laughs> an, up, an up throw was enough to bait him over, and Turi takes the game 2 0. 2 0, and yeah, really hard. I mean, l look at the lineup from Turi, like. A lot of good characters, two of the top uh, top characters by a lot of people. But yeah, and now we have uh, we are here in B2.